Hey, what's up? Hey, how's the flying coming along? Yeah, well, shit, man, I was gonna holler at you about that, cause, you know, I'm... <laughs> Will you listen to yourself? Admit it. You're scared. Maybe just a little. Until you've walked right into the middle of a Bedouin arms dealer's camp with nothing but a briefcase full of cash, you don't know the meaning of fear. Oh, uh, yeah? Try going to the swap me night of wood sometime. Learn to fly, Carl. What you want, Torino? Well, what do you want, Carl? You want your brother out of jail? Okay, listen. I'm trying, man. I really am. I'm gonna let you in on a little secret, Carl. The one difference between those that tried and died, and those that still walk this earth, is belief in self. Nothing is impossible, Carl. Beat your fears, focus your mind, and learn to fly! Okay, okay, I'll... Torino! Oh, shit! Oh, uh, hi, Z. You wasn't around when I signed the deeds. Yes, I know. I was on a dangerous reconnaissance mission, deep into enemy territory. Uh, yeah, right, sure, whatever you say. I should come through and have a look at the business, you know? Oh, of course, of course. I'll have to tidy up a bit. This place is such a mess. Don't worry about it. I'll drop in soon. Hey, what up, Z? Nothing is up, Carl. Apart from my blood pressure. And the imminent collapse of my hopes and dreams. Why? As usual, the forces of darkness have triumphed over good. Life is nothing but misery, briefly interspersed with agony. Homie, what you own? Whatever it is, you need to reduce the dosage. <laughs> Excuse me, but I never take drugs. We all know drugs are for losers and or sex maniacs. And right now, sex is the last thing on my mind. Thank God for that. Berkeley is back. Oh, Berkeley. Yes. Who the fuck is Berkeley? Oh, just a man I once beat in fair competition. A man literally obsessed with revenge. Oh, you put hands on him? No, please. <laughs> I never initiate violence. Oh, I know. You knocked this bitch. Uh, no. I won the prize in the science fair. <laughs> First prize, that is. And now you want to pop you? <laughs> no. And they say gangbangers is petty and small-minded. Hey, what's that bleeping sound? That's him. We shall fight to the end! Berkeley's launched a full-scale attack. This is insanity! All batteries commence fire! He's going for my transmitters! If he takes them out, I'll never be able to launch a counter-attack. No problem, man, but they're only toys. They're not toys. They're just smaller. CJ, bogey's at 12 o'clock! Don't get cocky! RC Baron's at 9 o'clock high, Carl! 
Wow. Berkeley. <laughs> as long as we have opposable thumbs, we will fight you. Well done, Carl. Now leave. I must prepare for the battles ahead. Never have so few owed so many. Too little three... No, that's not it. What is it? We will fight him on the beaches. Well, rooftops. Humongous brain fungus. House on SFUR. This is what trendy people like. Marshall Jefferson blowing the roof off my head. I need a hug. <laughs> Sabrina! Carl, learn to fly. I'm on it, man, I swear. Hey, me, I'm on it, man, right there. Same old broken record, Carl, but that's fine. Cause your brother's getting a new cellmate tonight. Horse cock Harry, and I'm sending a present, little wedding present. Big tub of lube. Shit, dude, okay, okay, I swear, man, I'm gonna be the best pilot. I'd love to hear you, Carl, I can't hear you. All I can hear is your brother's love cries, as eight kilometers of cock finds its way up his ass. Oh, that's your brother, okay? No big problem. Wait, please, man! That was my last motivational speech, understand? Am I being too spiritual for you, Carl? Okay, man. I get the message.
Hey, Z, where you at? Go away, Carl. I'm, I'm very, very busy back here. Top, top secret stuff, not for your eyes. Too sensitive. Come on, homie, where are you? I said go away, Carl. I don't need any friends today. Thank you. <laughs> Man, them some pretty strong draws. Yes, my hero. Carl, he came back and humiliated me. I shall probably turn to prostitution now, where I will be found dead and broken. I am a 28-year-old man whose landlord just helped him down from a hook from which I had been hanging from my underwear, contemplating my inadequacy for nearly two hours. Ow! My crack. Look, you gotta get even, homie. What kind of weapons you got? Uh, I've got a prototype of a miniature plane. Huh, <laughs> well with that plane, we gonna go humiliate Burke. Mm. Okay, cool. Man, this is ridiculous. That went right up my crack. Berkeley has his sycophantic lackeys do all his deliveries. Well, we shall hit him where it hurts the most. Bring his mail order model business to its knees. Launch the Red Baron. we have.
one piece before she runs out of fuel. Watch your fuel, Carl. Only half a tank left. Zero? I'm off to engage with destiny, good or bad. What the hell are you talking about now? The hour of judgment is upon me, and I must ask myself if I am a sheep or a goat. Carl, will you be my second? Here are some letters. I've left everything to you in case I don't make it. Please. Already own it! What's wrong with you, man? We are crossing the Rubicon. I am to engage in battle with Berkeley. At stake, honor, and our very lives. It's funny. I've never noticed before how beautiful this time of year can be. I may never again see Rome in the springtime. <laughs> a butterfly. Come on with all the talking, man. Is you gonna battle Berkeley or what? It's a fight to the death! Come hither! Behold, no man's land. Man, y'all take this shit seriously. Berkeley's headquarters is across no man's land. I'll drive the bandit, you fly the goblin, and help any way you can. If I get the bandit into Berkeley's base, he must leave San Fierro for good. Let battle commence! Carl, don't be an idiot. Use the goblin to move that barrel. Berkeley's using tanks! Carl, grab a bomb and get rid of any tanks that threaten our progress. Carl, I'm blocked!
There's another cursed barrel in the way! Move it! Carl, Berkeley's blocked me again! Curse you, Berkeley! Carl, move that barrel! Carl, move that obstruction! Carl, I'm blocked! Berkeley, you, sir, are a loser. Leave the field of battle in shame, pack up your crummy mail-order business, and get out of my town! Carl, you were all a duelist like me could want in a second. Sir, I salute you. Thank <laughs> you.